Want to see the newest button lock knife from Vosti? Stick around and we'll check it out together. Hey everybody, welcome back to Big Red EDC. Well, yes, indeed, we have the newest Vosti knife, and it is a button lock. This is the Raccoon. Now, I have just gotten this in. I have not taken a look at it yet, so I kind of wanted to take a look at it for the first time with you guys. So, let's do just that. Now, with most of the Vosti's knives that I have seen, they come in these really nice metal cases. Very cool, kind of gray with a little bit of red. Of course, you got the Vosti logo there. Very nice. Uh, the packaging packaging shows, and a, a lot of people ask me, what do you care about packaging? It shows, a lot of times it shows that companies care. They take the time to present their knives well. And you know what? If you take time to do that, hopefully, hopefully, I can't say for sure, but hopefully, you're going to take time to make your knife right as well. Now, as you can see, it does come in this really nice, really nice case here. Very, very cool. Now, <clears throat> just as a reminder, Vosteed is no longer working with Kaiser. They used to work with Kaiser, but they are no longer. And uh, basically, Corinne told me they're just working with a different manufacturer. That's all she said. <gasps> Dude. Oh, yeah, I don't, I mean, now, I have to say, Corinne from Vosteed did send this out to me. I don't know if this comes in every one, but that would be cool. I'll have to ask her. Nice, Vosteed patch. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. Of course, you get, there you go, Vosteed.com. There you go. Some info. Oh, what is this? Is this a sticker? I think it is. Want it dead or... Oh, dude. <laughs> if that's a sticker, that's cool. I like that. That's cool. That's very cool. And what else? We have another card here. Oh, we got our info card. Really nice. So, okay. There you go. We'll take a look at it real quick. 14C28N. Three and a quarter inch. Drop point. Flat ground. Stonewash finish. Green micarta. And it has a plunge lock. So it's a button lock, like I said, and of course, there you go. You get a cleaning cloth. So dang, you get quite a bit with this knife. All right, cool, cool. Again, companies go the little extra mile to send you some stuff. You know, that never hurts. That never hurts. All right, so here you go. Here is the raccoon itself. Very cool. Oh, nice micarta. Digging that. Oh, micarta backspacer as well. Very nice. Uh, loop over pocket clip. Ooh, looks like it's inset into the liner. Very good. And it is reversible. Awesome. Lanyard hole. Very good. Mostly open construction. We do have that. What do we say? That's probably about, I'll say 75%. 75% open construction. We do have that. Take a quick look at our centering. That looks pretty good. Take a feel of the micarta. Now you can tell. Check that out. You can tell how chamfered that is. That looks really nice. It is flat. There's no contouring. So they are pretty much flat scales. So that's all right. No issue there. And the button lock is kind of inset. That's going to be interesting. I'm going to... You can see it's inset into that liner. And it doesn't protrude very much at all. So all right. We'll, we'll figure out how that works out. Dual thumb stud deployment. As the looks of it so all right let's check it out okay now button lock okay not bad detent seams what's that detent like not bad not bad flips out very nicely button lock tiny bit of stick right at the moment not too bad just a little bit just a little bit and all right, here's the, do the stand up. Yeah, it took it about, oh, what am I gonna say? 80 degrees for it to come shut. Not bad though. No, that's not bad at all. Action's pretty decent. 
Not bad, not bad at all. And I was kind of concerned about the inset of that button, but it's actually inset, so it does kind of prevent it being pushed while it's in your pocket. Not like I'm really too worried about that. I really never... It's not an auto, so I've never been too worried about, you know, deploying a button lock knife in my pocket. That's, I guess that's just something I never really thought about. <laughs> you know, a non-auto button lock knife. But hey, you know what? They took extra, they took an extra measure. So you know what? I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Okay. Quick look. Nice. Feels pretty good in hand. I can, oh, Eclipse low profile. Goodness. Goodness gracious. It's, it is low profile. Um, I can feel that portion a little bit. So we'll see how it goes. Initial grip, you can choke up some, sure. Solid, absolutely. Very solid, very solid. No issue. No, no up and down, no side to side. All right. You know, overall, just as a first look, what do we got written on there? Oh, we got the raccoon, raccoon, 1420, 14C28N. Yeah. Not bad, not bad. Of course, I will carry this, uh, use it, take it to work. We'll see how it goes. And I will give you a full review coming on it very soon. But right off the bat, I don't really have anything really too bad to say about it. Like I said, I can feel that pocket clip a little bit. So we'll see how it, you know, when I go to use it at work, we'll see some constant use if it becomes an issue. But right off the bat... Yeah, I have no issues with this knife whatsoever. So, cool. Very good. Well, guys, just wanted to do a quick unboxing with you today. Check it out. I do like that blade. I like the blade shape. But we won't get too crazy. I want to do a full review on it here coming up, but I'm digging that blade. Absolutely. Now, I did notice I've seen quite a few out there, but I did see on the website where it says they will begin delivery on November 28th, Monday. So, but I've seen a few of them out there, so not really sure exactly how that works. I'll have to talk to uh, Corinne about it for sure. But I will say, guys, if you remember the Edge Addicted Facebook group, um, Vostid is actually hosting a giveaway on in our group. So that was re very cool of Corinne to do that as well. But Back to the raccoon. First look, uh, you know, I, I'm I'm not I'm not unhappy. Put it that way. Uh, I'm digging it. First off, so come back. I'll tell you. I'll use it for a little while, and I'll give you a full my full thoughts on it after using it. And we'll do a full review. But thanks a lot for checking out the unboxing today, guys. As always, like, subscribe, leave me that comment. You know I love talking to you. Until next time, guys. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye-bye.